speaking from from a couple of guys who have tried that in the past. This has not worked. So Justin on the first player side, fighting from Southern California. Farong and Chun, as we expected. Cami first. Yes, Ramos playing that. Cami Vega. Cami Vega, no gems. Did Justin pick gems? I actually didn't see. Oh, actually, Ramos is popping uh, off stage, I think going to talk with somebody. Looks like. I think he might be going to change his controller or something. These guys oh, all. Man. They all use like PlayStation controllers. They all use those converters. No, he didn't get anything. I think he just went to go talk, chat a little bit. Yeah, you're right. He just turned off gems. And he's playing with no gems. So he will be gemless. So he is the only player to not play with gems that I know of, period. Yeah. In this whole world. Yeah. <laughs> you know, because the gem system actually became a lot easier with the update. Sure. Yeah, there, there was five presets so that you didn't have to think anymore. Right. And he says, you know what? I'll choose the sixth. The sixth option. None. Different gems make you build meter faster. They make you do more damage. They give you more life. But he's going to forego all of that. And I, and I find it odd that Justin would use Faring as a lead character. I feel he's more of a second guy in, when you link him with Chun, when you team him with Chun. So. I think his team is awesome in, in both directions. I think it's, re it's really good, especially for Justin. Like I said, he, he pretty much plays Huarong as sweet uh, Huarong. Some, yeah, sometimes like walk back, fade away kick. That's really it. Well, you see that Ramos is starting to size him up. And you see, since Justin favors that sweep, he's too concentrated on the ground game. And that's why guys like Infiltration can jump in on him because they know what he's looking for. Oh, that delay. Oh, missed it. Uppercut. Uh-oh, big damage. R Ramos definitely wanted the instant air dive kick right there and didn't get it. And he lost all that life in part. Because of that, he's going to lose the round too. That is a huge, huge problem for him. To yeah. just have that executional error and it turns into the round loss. Great job by Justin to take advantage though. But that's not a good feeling if you're Ramos. And Ramos just getting swept forever. That far ring sweep is going a lot further than uh, even I thought. <laughs> right, yeah. And you see right now... That's how Justin makes it look. Whoa, he hit that cross-up. Oh, and here comes the pretty one, Vega. I think Vega is super good in this game, too. He's definitely good in this game. And of course, you're going to backdash. Uh-oh, what's the Oh, good block. High-low game. Okay, so Chun-Li right there is, I think, uh, negative one or plus one or something. So she can't really get punished. Ooh. Oh, punish, punish, punish. Nice. Oh, he doesn't. He just backdashed. That was kind of hard to punish. It's possible. Oh, this time. Oh, here comes the big high. damage from Justin. And he's getting all that meter in the background as well. Oh, wow. And Ramos was looking to confirm that into a tag. But unfortunately, he didn't get the hit. Hey, you can really see Justin's control style. Walks back. The, the mix-ups that he goes for are, are very light. And if he sees that they're not working out, no big deal. He can back off. Exactly. Justin's risk factor is extremely low. Oh, get this damage, though. All right, so what is Ramos going to do here? Ramos has no gems, so he's playing with honest damage. Oh, Chun-Li with that roundhouse kick. I like it. Oh, I've never seen that combo before. <laughs> oh, that was pretty sick right there, that too. That was the most damage oh. you could get. Oh, he's got to turn this into the round. Did he confirm that? That was hot. That was really nice, okay, yeah. Okay, so Ramos playing with this team. He has synergy down to the science. Yeah, Cammy, I think, is, is really good in this game, too. She has some great buttons. Yeah. And depending on good how low you too. hit the dive kick, it's still an effective tool. Yeah, he's been using it quite a bit. Oh, the patience. That's the kind of thing that Justin kind of forces on you. Oh, love that walk-up grab. Did he just walk in and throw? The audacity. That's what I like. And uh oh, big damage. We got, Justin punishes it. We got two for one special. Justin should have tagged and kept it going. Yeah, he, he could have gotten the round, yeah. Yeah, I think he could have potentially have knocked out Vega. Stayed I mean, in sorry, front. Knocked out Cammy. Look at this damage, though. Wow, Justin wanting it all. He's not going to be able to kill, but he had a couple of uh, meter gems active, so yeah, meter, so meter waste is not that is. high. And Justin um, Wong takes the first game. That was super ambiguous, by the way. I didn't know if that was going to hit in the front or in the back. In this game, usually when you go for those kind of ambiguous setups in the corner, you end up in front. It's, it's kind of rare that you actually end up behind in, in a real cross-up. You can see the patience now from Ramos. And again, he misses the dive kick. That jump around is supposed to be dive kick. And misses the combo, too. Definitely has some jitters up there.
Just in safe. Ooh, there it is. that was a great punish from Ramos. And look at the damage that he got from that. No gems. Yeah, that's right. Oh, and if he would have standing middle kick against that whiff roundhouse, that would have been lovely. Oh, wow. No what? No and respect. Ramos turns it into a combo anyway. Oh, and Ramos. Wow, that confirms off the jab, though. I like how Ramos is playing. I really like how he's playing Kami and uh, Vega. He's really maximizing these characters. What? He went for an air throw? That was ridiculous. <laughs> It didn't work out, but that would have been so cool. Yeah, right? Jumped, up, jumped behind him, hit the corner, and came back. Stays in the corner. Very few rolls on wake-up. Just in general today. Well, it's just it's just sad to lose all that red life, you know? Wow, and Justin getting that damage. So, you know, a, a big thing about cross Tekken is that one jab can lead into everything. Right. So people are kind of desperate to hit a low jab sometimes. And if you time your low jab kind of meaty, you can exploit that. Oh, he was looking for another low attack from Justin. Launch will go right through that, but it didn't come. Oh, I, I like that. That was That's some good damage. But I think Justin could have got more. Well, Justin's not in the business of taking big risks. and That's true. I think, like, Justin, this plays to Justin's strengths of uh, frustrating the opponent, playing a very, very slow game. Right. Not, not taking very many risks. Right. Just you coming to him and dying. There's that stand forward kick that you talked about. Really good. Great hitbox on it. Good range. Oh, and Ramos, you have to walk back and forth to use a low drop. Nice confirm. Is Ramos that good? He's had great confirms. Oh, woo! That combo looks so good. Overhead. Yes, I'm waiting for it. Oh, and then he tried to walk in a little too much, and Justin gets his chun out of yeah, there. Harm, he was thinking full about life. landing another overhead. I think he was totally going for it. And right now, I think that it's definitely Ramos' favor. He like has a little bit more life than Justin. Oh, maybe not so much anymore. Yeah, I don't. I don't think so. Oh yeah. No, now you're trying to force the offense, Ramos. Stop. Keep Vega in. Oh, oh and he just can't claw back. Did you see that? that That's why he dashed forward. That so was really nice. Sick. You're right. You're right. Uppercut. He's okay. getting desperate oh. now. He's feeling like he needs to jump. The time is running Rush out. Rush too much. Time yeah, I see him dashing. I look at that. Justin, Justin, Justin has knows. It. Justin doesn't. Justin doesn't care anymore. I don't think that. I don't think that does enough. Oh, that, that might be enough. Will it be enough? Will it be enough? No, it's not. Gonna no, be enough. it's not going to be enough. All wow. right. I and like the idea. He just didn't have enough time. And just like that, all the tournament veterans advance to the second round.